Year 7 Biology. Welcome. Are you excited for a fun learning session? Make sure you have your book and a pen before we start. Today you are going to learn about breathing. Breathing. Inhalation means breathing in. Exhalation means breathing out. The respiratory system includes the windpipe, lungs and diaphragm. To inhale the intercostal muscles between the ribs contract to pull the ribs up and out, and the diaphragm pulls down and flattens. This causes the pressure in the chest to lower it becomes lower than the pressure of the air outside the body. When the diaphragm is raised and the ribs are down, then there is a small volume, when there is a small volume the particles are all close together, so the pressure is high. When the diaphragm is lowered and the ribs are spread up and out the volume is larger, when there is a larger volume, the particles can move further apart, and the pressure is lower. This causes air to move into the lungs to equalize the pressure. To exhale the intercostal muscles between the ribs relaxes, and this moves the ribs down and in, and the diaphragm curves up towards the lungs. This causes the volume of the chest to decrease, and so the pressure increases. To equalize the pressure the air in the lungs is forced out. Breathing rate is the number of breaths taken per minute. The resting breathing rate of a person is how many breaths per minute a person takes when they are at rest. When an individual exercises their breathing rate increases, this is because the muscles and tissues need extra oxygen. The harder an individual exercises the more their breathing rate will increase, 